Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Claire Silver and tonight I'm going to be doing an 8x8 Dutch pour. Um, it's earth themed. I've already done two canvases on video number five and video number seven. Um, the one on video number five looked like it was fire themed. Well, it was meant to be fire themed. It looks more like lava. Um, and the video number seven, it kind of reminded me of water, so I was going to go earth, air, fire, water. So tonight I thought I'd do an earth inspired pour. So I'll get you down on the canvas and we'll get started. Okay everyone, this piece is from my fifth video. This is one of the pieces that's inspired tonight's pours. So yeah, it's totally dry, but I'll show you the orange one and the blue one together just to give you an idea of what I'm going for. Okay guys, here's the two pieces that inspired one of tonight's pours. Um, this one was from video number five. I think I said it was from video number four in a previous video. It's video number five. And this one was from video number seven. Um, I just thought they would look like water. A fire, maybe do an earth one and an air one. So, yeah, let's get painting. Welcome, everybody. Like I said, tonight's Dutch board is going to be earth themed. Um, I've taped up the back, I've put some push pins in just to keep it elevated off the table. I've also took my level and I've leveled it all out. I'm going to try to blow this out the exact same way as video number five and video number seven. Um, if you want to go check them out, one of them looked like fire and one of them looked like water. So that's where we're at just now. So I will flood my canvas and I will talk you through the colours that I'm using tonight. And then I'm just going to take my finger and run it along my edges, like so. Make sure my corners have got a good covering on them. Right. So the first colour I'm going to put down tonight, I'm going to quickly torch this actually guys, you can see a couple of air bubbles before I put my colours down. So the first colour I'm going to put down tonight is Phalo Green and this is by Daler Brownie. Um, I'm just going to put a puddle, I've been kind of going off centre slightly down here so we'll start there. So that's the Phalo Green and then followed by here I have some Iridescent Copper by Pebio Studio Acrylics. Put some of that in. I thought I'd put in a touch of blue just for water inspired because it's earth. So yeah, I thought I'd put in some blue. This is cyan blue. That is also by David Remy. And then I thought I'd put in some iridescent gold by Pebble Studio Acrylics. And last but not least, this is Pale Green by Arteza. I've had it mixed up in this bottle for ages. I've never really used it, so we'll use some of that tonight. I'll do maybe a zigzag along like so. So I'm gonna flood with my base of white, like so. And then I'm gonna blow over and blow it out. See where we go from there. I'm going to quickly torch this. There's some bubbles, air bubbles appeared in it, just as I blew it over. And then I'm just going to blow it out, guys. Uh, 
and then again I'm just gonna blow the rest out with my mouth I might actually take one of the pieces down to try and match it up with the other pieces yeah one second this I think is gonna have to match up with that so I'm gonna have to kind of blow this out to about here and then I'll be happy with that so yeah like so quickly torch it pretty much happy with that guys yeah I'm just gonna leave it at that Okay guys, I'll get you down for a close-up. Okay guys, here it is. We 8x8 eight eight Earth Inspired Dutch Pour. Oh, I'll try to get you in for a close-up. Yeah. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you would like to see more videos, please subscribe to my channel. It would be greatly appreciated. Everything will be in the description below guys. Paints used, float all my Instagram account, email address. There'll also be a link to art discount. That's where I get most of my supplies from. Yeah. Okay guys, take care. Bye.